Slate V presents your guide to the worst cinematic crap that's ever been made. Hello class, I'm Mark Jordan Legan, your substitute teacher for the day, and I expect you to treat me with the same respect and dignity as you would your regular teacher. Thank you. Now, as the school year is winding down class, I'm going to show you clips from the worst anti-drug film ever made. No, it's not Reefer Madness from 1936. This well-meaning but hopeless morality tale is 1990's Cartoon All-Stars to the Rescue! As our little opus starts, a pot-crazed brother is stealing from his cute Aryan-looking sister. All right! There must be 20 bucks in here, easy! So as you can see, this film was made to educate kids about the dangers of marijuana and bad 90s animation. I hate to suggest this, but my guess would be marijuana. An unlawful substance used to experience artificial highs. You know what's weird? My voice used to sound like that when I was high. Is he kidding? You know, kid, you don't look so good. What's this? A joint? You know, I think Bugs said that a dozen times to Daffy Duck. And if things weren't strange enough in this movie, Bugs Bunny takes Michael and puts him in a time machine. We're getting high. You know. <coughs> hey, way to connect with post-punk American youth. Let's dress them like characters well, yeah, from Archie sure, and Jughead comics. Want a hit? What's the matter? You scared? No. No. So, you still think it was your choice? Well, I didn't want him to think I was a wimp. Better a wimp than an all-day sucker. Oh, a little interesting side note. See the little smoke demon there talking to the boy all the time? That smoke demon is voiced by Academy Award-winning legendary actor George C. Scott. Hey, lighten up on my man here. He was just experimenting with some friends. And in classic anti-drug fashion, they show Michael the damage he's doing to his brain. Where am I? Well, you're about to take a trip through the human brain. I'm sure a few of us have been buzzed before and felt like the Muppet Babies were taking a roller coaster ride through our brain. And by the way, folks, when this thing premiered, it was broadcast simultaneously on all three broadcast networks. And now to really take a right turn into Bizarroville. Who's that? Well, it's not Freddy Krueger. This is you. Who better to scare you straight than Alf? You use, you lose. We care about you, Mikey. What's up, Doc, is your life, if you don't cut it out. There's nothing cool about a fool on drugs. Go on, push it. And as you can see, just like most people's interventions, everyone from the Smurfs to Winnie the Pooh show up to be a buzzkill. What a nightmare. I'll say. Gosh, that song. I know it's meant to help, and yet it's ringing in my head, haunting me even. It's almost like I need to escape to make it stop. Oh, well. Thanks, Muppet Babies, for singing and scaring me straight. For Slate V, I'm Mark Jordan Legan. And remember, better a wimp than an all-day sucker. Everybody.